The extremely high temperature in Italy left people queuing at the capital's many fountains and drinking fountains known as Big Noses or Nasoni that constantly gush fresh water and are a great help when wanting to cool off. With soaring temperatures, drought conditions are rapidly spreading throughout Italy, with rivers and reservoirs drying up and the forecast of higher temperatures likely to make things worse. I've been here in Rome for six years, and there have been summers as hot as this one. But other summers, like last year, weren't as hot, at least not as early as June, so I can't really say. The heat we are having in May and June isn't what we are used to. We've got 40 degrees in June. July and August will be terrifying. There's no water. There's the drought. It is a very serious problem. Italy's northern lakes were already below or close to record lows, with the level of natural reservoirs in central Italy also plunging. The Tiber River is at a multi-year low, while the flow rate of the Anien River has halved. The Lazio region, centred on Rome, declared a state of emergency last week, imposing restrictions in some communities, including bans on hose pipe usage and filling swimming pools. The temperature increase and this heat wave are linked to climate change. I firmly believe it. They are deeply linked. Also, a few years ago, it wasn't that hot, so it is getting worse.